Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, Danio here. And yes, as you can read from the title, I'm gonna show you how to make purple noodles. I'm also gonna show you my son eating these purple noodles. Now, you're thinking purple noodles, like why would you make purple noodles? Because it's unicorn food. <laughs> I'm just playing, no. Well, it could be, I guess, with the whole unicorn movement. But purple noodles, I saw purple noodles and um, somewhere on Instagram and I was like, oh my goodness, A, I have to try it. B, maybe it's the only way I can get my son to eat. Mamas, testify. Sometimes it is just hard to get your kid to eat. I can make the best meal setup. Okay, I can sh I can I can put his little vegetables on the side with some meat and a little bit of you know mac and cheese or something, and he'll be like, I don't want it, and I'm just like, really, really though, like what's a mother to do, you know? A mother's gonna make purple noodles, so I'm gonna show you how I make this, and then we're gonna do the taste test with my son and see if he likes them. Let's head on over into the Daniel kitchen and get right into it. Okay, so purple noodles. What I love with this whole process is that it's done entirely naturally with purple cabbage. Okay, so I'm going to bring my purple cabbage to a complete boil and you may not notice it, but the water is starting to turn blue. I'm then going to add, these are um, the Thai rice um, noodles, I believe. Um, I picked these because I felt like they would be very easy to um, absorb the dye. I don't know if you could do it with like regular spaghetti. Ah, it's happening. You'll notice that the noodles are starting to take a little bit of color. We're going to set that aside for about eight to 10 minutes to do its thing. Now I'm deciding to make so, you know, some protein, put some, add some protein on the side. So in a little bit of olive oil, maybe I put a little too much there. I'm going to fry some pieces of chicken breast. I'm going to lightly season this with some salt and my homemade uh, blended spice, which has like garlic and all that fun stuff in it. So you fry until you're desired, well obviously until cooked. Um, there I got a little distracted and they almost burnt on me, but uh, you get the picture. I'm gonna set that aside and return to the noodles who have, you can see, fully almost taken some kind of color. I'm going to squeeze some fresh lime, no, lemon juice, yeah. Oh, and look at that. It's like chemistry class all over again. They're turning pink, but they're still kind of purple. You know, I don't know. You're gonna let it sit. And the more you squeeze it, the more it kind of changes color. So um, that's really up to you. I'm gonna mix it a little bit in with the chicken so it can get some of that flavoring. And voila, ha ha. Purple noodles. So purple noodles. I'm gonna call my son and get him to come and eat it. Um, I guess I should taste it. You can hear him coming down, right? I guess I should taste it first, since I'm the mother, and make sure it's not gonna poison him because I didn't taste it yet. It didn't. It just didn't occur to me to, to taste it. Um, I don't know. Looking at it now, it's looking a little questionable, a little gross, but you know, tastes like brothless soup. I should have put maybe a little bit more salt. But let's see what my little man says. Come on, baby bear. What's that, he asked. <laughs> little does he know. Okay. Dis bonjour tout le monde. Bonjour tout le monde. Ici dans la caméra, fait bonjour avec les mains. Bonjour tout le monde. Bonjour tout le monde. Okay. Alors, maman t'a fait des nouilles. C'est quelle couleur ça? C'est ça. Violet. Yes, violet. Pur purple. My favorite of Jagas, y'all. Okay, so, I'm going to make the nouilles pour jus. Oh, yes, the nouilles violet pour jus. Tu vas goûter? Mm, oui. Oui, oui, parce que c'est violet, hein? Oui. C'est de les nouilles pour les unicorns. Is that how you say unicorn in French? I don't know. Okay, we'll find out. Okay, t'es prêt? Oui. Viens, viens à côté de moi, plus près de moi. Plus près. Oh, on doit prier. Venez ici, c'est mieux. I pray before you eat it, you know. You don't know what's gonna happen afterwards. It's bon, eh? Mm -hmm. Tu veux manger ça? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so um, my boy disappeared, 
And I still have a bowl full of unicorn food, purple noodles. And I guess that's why he didn't eat it because he is a boy and not a unicorn. Actually, he took a couple of bites. He took a couple of bites and he ate some chicken. I think it's because it's really bland. Like, I, I forgot to boil it with salt, so I would recommend adding some salt to the water when you're boiling the mix. And if it wasn't for the chicken and the little bit of mixture I did, it would have no flavor. So that's probably where we went wrong, but I'm confident I can get him to have more bites, maybe not eat an entire bowl. Which means that even unicorn food isn't good enough for my three-year-old. I guess the mom's just gonna keep, you know, gonna have to keep on trying. What's a mom to do? <laughs> Anyways, um, would if you eat purple, uh, purple noodles? Share in the comments below. Maybe it's a little too much, I don't know. But for a kid, I thought it would, you know, do it a little bit, of, give him a little bit of intrigue, make him interested to eat it. So, you know, a mom's gotta do what a mom's gotta do. Comment below. If you like this video, thumbs up. Don't forget to share, share. And uh, of course, if you haven't done so already, Subscribe, subscribe to my channel. I'm also gonna remind you to check out danio.com where I have different themes and subjects and content that I post that maybe don't make it to video. For instance, this week I'm posting about our DIY paper mache homemade piggy bank, teaching the child the value of a dollar at a young age. I'm pretty sure my son has about $10 worth of change in here in nickels. Remember that you are beautiful and you are smart and you are loved. Yes. And I hope you enjoy your entire week. And until then, I will see you in my next video. He's back for more noodles. Let's do it. Mmm.